explain you about how to android studio we can filter that locks so first you need to go with uh plugins experiment you need to enable that new logs tools windows enabled or not after that you can click ok then you need to jump it out <coughs> the filter log you need to jump it out the filter logs filter lock then you can expand that log window then you can see that modify that these are all types of log will display due to that error warning information and debug this mode only it is available on the log on the log view so you have to identify that which one log we made in our android studio coding once that if your log is done you need to tag that which tag you used you have to mention it automatically that filter will work so if you have some levels like a, or error kind of things level verbs or error you can put it like that so all the log will be displayed like this for kind of format or debug you can see that things very easily to identify that how log is managed before we have some filters they implemented now we need to use that logs based on that keywords from our side from levels and tags and project package names and ever if you this video if you satisfied please share and subscribe thank you